I picked up a stabilizer for my camera. If you guys are into filmmaking, you know what this is. It kind of stabilizes the shots and makes everything look smooth. It's not as good as a gimbal. That's why this thing is so cheap. And uh, hopefully in the future I'm able to purchase a gimbal, but let's go ahead and unbox this and see how this is. Alright guys, what's up? Me and Chandler and Dune just got back from eating. And uh, actually, we got back and then we headed out to go to Best Buy to see if they had the Gorilla Pod, and then they ended up not having it, but I seen something else and it was on a discount. And I used like a $10 card and Dune's discount as well. Like in total, I got this for like $20. I've been wanting one for a really long time, and I ended up getting it. So I wanted to like unbox it and kind of review it almost. So I picked up a stabilizer for my camera. If you guys are into filmmaking, you know what this is. It kind of stabilizes the shots and makes everything look smooth. It's not as good as a gimbal. That's why this thing is so cheap. And uh, hopefully in the future I'm able to purchase a gimbal, but let's go ahead and unbox this and see how this is. I just gotta get it level. So it comes with the the gimbal, well not the gimbal, but the uh, actual stabilizer itself. And it comes with one weight attached to it already, and then two other weights right here to counterbalance the camera. So I'm gonna throw these weights on here. In the picture, it shows that they have like all these weights on to carry a DSLR. So that's what I'm gonna do as well. And then I'm just gonna try to almost calibrate it pretty much or balance it out so that everything is balanced with the camera on. so right now I'm gonna put my camera on this and then I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like after I have it all balanced so let's do this all right all right so, ooh, I could just do this and then throw it into stabilization mode all right I got this thing strapped on and I'm gonna show you guys in the mirror what it looks like and then we'll do some test shots So this is what it's looking like all set up. Pretty rad. I'm stoked on it. It's actually like pretty stable and like it was quick to cap like almost uh not calibrate but um to like set everything up. It swings a lot which is I just got got to get used to because my camera is really heavy and the counterbalance is pretty heavy as well but overall this thing is like completely balanced like for just like quick movements so right now I'm going to go do some test shots and then see what this looks like let's go do it
All right, so I tested out the uh, stabilizer. I like it. Um, I just really need to work with it a lot to get really used to it, and uh, I think it's going to be beneficial to cinematic, uh, like filmmaking, and cinematography. And I'm looking forward to using it a lot more. I want to use it for music videos because I know a lot of friends that do music, and I want to make the music videos because we've been talking about it a lot. We just haven't put it into action yet. But for right now, me and Chandler are going to go to. He's going to get a haircut and. We're going to freaking, what is it called, UPS to take the internet modem and to uh, AutoZone to get some stuff for my car. So we're going to do that. Alright, so I'm starting getting hang of this and I really want to do some more tests on it. So we're going to do some like running stuff. Let's see how this works. Let's do just one straight. It's okay. I'm gonna just like look at these clips and see how they look afterwards. Ooh, all right. Let's see what these looks like. Yo, so I can see myself really growing onto this thing. <clears throat> um, I I can really use it for a lot of stuff, um, with traveling videos and um, a lot of music videos and stuff of that. But um, yeah, I, that's that's kind of my reaction to this whole thing. I really like it a lot. But other than that, right now I'm gonna eat some a bowl of cereal. And that's going to be my last meal of the day. Uh, actually, right before I started vlogging right now, uh, me and Chandler went to Burger King and picked up a veggie burger. And it was, it was like insanely good. I rate it higher than um, the burgers that we made, <clears throat> even though ours were cheaper. And um, I don't know, it was just more convenient to go through Burger King. And because I could just pick it up. We saw the Hodge friends eating them. So we thought it was really good, and it was really good. It was like, it tastes just like a hamburger. It almost tastes like, I don't know, it was really good. But we give it a thumbs up, and um, so tomorrow morning we are paying a fee and then leaving in the morning. Hopefully we leave as soon as possible, because I really want to go do some stuff after we get to our next destination, which I'll be talking about tomorrow. Um, but right now I think I'm going to go ahead and conclude this, so I can put it out for you guys. And... Um, just hope it's a good video for you guys and if you guys really do enjoy this vlog and enjoying these vlogs please give it a thumbs up and go subscribe to the channel if you get them to uh, 1k subscribers 1,000 um, it'll encourage them to make more videos right yeah <laughs> he actually has one video on his channel so go check that out it has around like close to 2,000 views go go give it a view give it it has 17,000 um, but go give that video a thumbs up and go check out his channel. I'll leave the link to it in the description. And yeah, peace out, guys. Oh, snap, look at my hair. So we're going to be up without internet for a while, but it's all gravy. I mean, we're leaving tomorrow, so we should be straight.